Hello, welcome to Marley's Music Class. I'm Marley, these are my daughters Ava Hi. and Hero. Hi. Now today we're going to be looking at prepared pianos, the composer John Cage and also avant-garde music. So firstly, prepared pianos. Have you ever heard of such a thing? Well, they're very fun. This is a piano, as you can see. This is what a piano sounds like. But what happens if we add books, spoons, uh, rubbers, um, some screws and bolts, and bits of paper. What happens if we add these to the strings? By the way, if you want to do this to your piano, ask your mum first, because she, she might not be very happy with me. Um, so what happens, what sound do we get? Well, let me play you a normal D, and let me play you a D that we have prepared. Oh, Normal. Changed, prepared. Drum-like, percussive. That's cool though. It sounds like um, a factory maybe, something quite mechanical. So everyone's got their own idea of what a prepared piano sounds like. So we've written a piece. Would you like to hear it? Are you ready? Yes. Let's play our prepared piano. avant-garde music. Now avant-garde means in French pioneering, new ideas, fresh new ideas. So John Cage was an avant-garde, fresh pioneering, new ideas kind of composer and he would write pieces like this on his prepared piano. Some people loved it, some people weren't so sure. He's like Marmite. He also wrote a very very famous piece and it's called Four Minutes and 33. Would you uh, would like to hear it? Yes. Four Minutes 33. Okay ready? <clears throat> <laughs> that's it! Well, that's not all of it, that's about 10 seconds. He wrote a piece that meant you, you didn't play the piano at all, you had to just be really quiet and just listen to all the other sounds around you. So it made you more aware of maybe the dog barking or the person next to you breathing or the other person next to you fidgeting a little bit or my creaky chair. So all of these things were going on and it made you listen to sound in a different way. Now some people love that idea, some people weren't so sure, but I think it's really fun. And if maybe now you're a fan of avant-garde music and of John Cage and of his new ideas, well then that's a great thing. So should we play our piece one more time? Yes. On the prepared okay. piano? Let's go. I hope you enjoyed the lesson today. I'm going to go and return this piano back to normal. If you did enjoy it, please press like and make sure you subscribe. It's completely for free. Thank you for joining the Class Girls for Marlene's Music Class. Bye. Bye. Bye.